When it comes to innovation in the game of golf, most people think about advances in technology with the equipment or the ball itself and helping with distance and control. But for owners of golf courses and driving ranges, it's this little gizmo zipping around behind me that's picking up momentum as quickly as it picks up golf balls. And it could probably pick up, I would think about 4,000 balls an hour. It's called Picker with an apostrophe R, a machine using artificial intelligence to navigate and collect golf balls all day long on a single charge. The Picker is an autonomous robot uh, that is electric, battery powered, lithium phosphate batteries that simply replaces the caged cart that pushes the ball picker around a driving range. We program the driving range via GPS, we map the range in different zones, and it automatically goes out and picks the balls. I didn't even know that it was driven by AI to begin with, but it was just really cool to see. With post-pandemic staff shortages still a concern at many golf clubs, this replaces the need for a human-operated traditional golf ball picker, often used as target practice. But that's not the only benefit. We used to have a gas picker that would be out there and this plugs in overnight, has a full charge and it's out there using no gas. Well, environmentally, obviously, it's very good. And, uh, you know, you'd like to see more golf courses do something similar. It's designed and built in Oshawa using mostly Canadian parts, including Canadian steel. So even if it does get hit, accidentally or not, it won't stop until the job is complete. They will take a fair bit of impact. Even if you did hit it with a, a low stinger, it's not going to hurt the robot. But wait, an AI-powered robot? It's not the kind of scenario that typically ends well in the movies. I mean, uh, maybe I'm wearing the, if I'm wearing a yellow shirt, it might come after me one day. Who knows? Instead of the yellow balls, right? Yeah. Don't, don't wear yellow. Don't wear yellow. Yeah, the rule is don't wear yellow to the range. That's it. Yeah. There's a camera on this device and if it sees someone go in front of it, it's going to stop automatically. So I know uh, they've tested it specifically for that and we've got no, no worries that it's going to run over our golfers. As for future uses on the golf course, you can expect to see the picker assisting with things like mowing and seeding. Just don't expect it to improve your short game. Sorry, picker. At Mill Run Golf Club, Rob Leth, City News.